Sup, boys and girls. Um, I've done a lot of research on this topic. Um, a lot of people ask how I get this date and time on a small taskbar. Because usually the only way to show the date and time in Windows is um, to make the taskbar like freaking fat, you know, like use uh, uncheck use small taskbar like this. And then it actually won't even show like this for you. It's going to show the date on the bottom and the time on the top or the time on the bottom and the date on the, I don't even remember because I've been using this for so long. Anyways, um, the only way to do this is with a third party program called Skinny Clock. So I'm going to show you how to set that up and everything today really fast. So let's bring this back to small and uh, just Google Skinny Clock. And the first result should be from Rawos. I think that raw OS, maybe that's what it stands for. Um, it's essentially uh, a little widget clock software, but it also has this little nifty option for you to overwrite your system clock. So to do that, go ahead and just run the installer. I'm just going to install it real quick. I already downloaded it, so okay. So you run the installer. You know how to install software. Just go hit next. Um, make sure to read the end user license agreement because if you don't, you're gonna get sued. Hit I accept. Hit next. Hit next, and choose your install location. Of course, um, I'm not gonna go through with this because I already have it installed. So I'm just gonna close out. But once you install it, you're actually not gonna see this. You're gonna see something like um, this in the upper right hand corner of your box once you run it. So. Um, to edit the settings, you want to go to your taskbar and find this little skinny clock icon. Oops, sorry about that. And just right click and hit settings. Now, here's what you're going to do. So, this controls the clock window, which is going to be, let me change this, this clock right here. There, you can see that a little bit better. So, you have like a little nice, if you like that, you can keep it, but I don't like it. I just, the main purpose of this program was to get this taskbar clock. So, um, I just make this fully transparent and it just disappears into oblivion. And now go ahead and click taskbar clock on the on the left. And this is where you're you're not gonna have anything right here first. You're just gonna have something like oh right doesn't show anything. So oh, uncheck. So this is what you're gonna start with. See, it just shows the time right now. So um, to change this, you want to put a C here, and C is basically the code for date and time. You can actually um, look at the predefined codes here. So there's actually a lot of different configurations. If you like, you can have the ones with the day too, one with the time, everything, and just hit insert and it'll insert it for you. And um, it, it'll preview and it'll show what that was. But C is the one that includes the date and the time in one string. So that's the one I like to use. And then check override taskbar clock and hit apply. And voila, you have date and time and seconds, which is actually more useful than you think in the taskbar um, without it being fat.